Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this Sea Sucker 4.5 inch vacuum mount with the stainless steel D-ring handle. Now this is a 4.5 inch pump action vacuum cup with stainless steel D-ring that will let you hang or secure a variety of objects to most horizontal or vertical non-porous surfaces with no tools required. Just uses this pump action vacuum and that creates about 120 pounds of pull strength without bending or scratching the surface it's attached to. If I take this cover off, you can see it's a nice hard rubber cup. And then as you pump that, it'll secure that to wherever you need to. You can attach it to or remove it to a surface in seconds. Now at the end of this video, I'm going to demonstrate attaching it this to, this to here just to show you how it works. The D-ring handle right here, it'll let you clip or hang items to it when it's installed. The slot it holds, let me zoom in a little bit so we can show you what I'm talking about. These slotted holes right here on the top of the housing, these will let you hang or bolt a variety of objects to them. Basically, if you remove these four screws, the housing will pop off. You can put your accessory with the, into that slotted hole and attach with bolts or nuts, and then put the housing back and screw it in. And the other way is if you look right in the center, there's a quarter inch by 20 stainless steel threaded insert that'll let you attach other Sea Sucker products to the top of the housing. You just thread right into there. They have additional accessories like flex mounts, camera mounts for the techies, and for marine use they'll have cup holders, fishing rod holders that'll attach to the insert. Very nice selection of items. Now all the metal parts are high grade stainless steel. Even the spring inside the pump itself is stainless steel for extra durability in the elements. The housing itself is a hard plastic construction. It's very lightweight and durable. I had mentioned this protective cap here which is nice. It has a little a tab on it. You just stick it under there, and then if you go all the way around it and push that cup into the cover, that cover will help protect it, keep it from hardening or cracking. Now this does come with a nice set of instructions that will describe how it operates, how you maintain it, and it will also come with this little tube of waterproof lubricant. And this will help prevent the plunger from sticking. What happens over time is where you're using this sometimes dirt or grime or build up in there, and as you push this down to plunge it, it actually will get sticky. So what you can do is actually just pull this plunger out, put the lubricant on it, or actually pull the plunger out, clean it, then put the lubricant on it, put it back in there, and then it'll work just like it does when it's new. You can see it's a nice black color. It is made in the USA. Load rating on this is 40 pounds. Pull rating is 120 pounds. The dimension on this, let me get the ruler out, show you the dimension on the cup, is going to be right at four and a half inches. Weight of it is only about eight ounces. So now what I'm going to do is we're just going to demonstrate. I'm going to slide this over. And this is a pretty heavy piece of metal, very thick piece of metal you can see here. Just want to demonstrate how this would attach. So what you want to do basically when you go to install this, you want to clean the mounting surface you're installing it to real good. Clean the face of the cup, make sure there's no dirt on there. And then it even says right here, moisten the seal before use. So this edge seal right here. I'm just going to wet my finger, run it around the edge. You want to moisten that pretty good. And then wherever you want to put it, let's say right there, and you want to apply it or put it to a place where you can actually see this orange band because that's going to tell you when you're pushing it how much suction you're having. So then all you have to do is put a little pressure on it and then just pump this plunger until the cup attaches completely and you can feel it attaching. And then you'll notice that orange band is gone. That means it's all suction. It's not going to go anywhere, you can't even take it off. Now if over time, if this is adhered and you start seeing the orange appearing, just push that plunger again to give it more suction and it'll work. Now to remove it, it's very simple. There's a tab up here and one down here. All you have to do is pull up on that tab, and when you do that, it removes very easily. Really simple to do. We'll demonstrate it again right over here. Put a little pressure on it, start pushing that plunger. And after a while, that plunger, that orange tab you can see is gone, and it's all secured to it. Hook anything to it, you're ready to go. And to remove it again, just pull up on that release tab, and it pops right off. Simple as that. <clears throat> but that should do it for the review on the Sea Sucker 4.5-inch vacuum mount with the stainless steel D-ring handle.